All right. Hi, everybody. I'm Stu Greenwald with the Empowered Light Holistic Expo. How are you? I'm here with John Smarty Mendez from holotech.biz. And I thought we'd like to talk today with you about what John will be doing at our expo that's coming up April 26th through 28th outside of Philadelphia in Oaks, PA. Oaks is outside of King of Prussia, for those that don't know. So John is commonly called Smarty, and I'm going to let him talk a little bit about what he's doing, but if you'd like to see him live and in person, he'll be at the expo. He'll be talking Saturday at 1 p.m. in the Awaken Room, and he'll uh, be doing a very nice presentation, but he'll be there all weekend to interact with you and to answer your questions. So, hey, Smarty, please tell us about how you got started with Holotech. Well, I, I started with Holotech back in 2012 when, uh, when uh, a quantum physics brought the concept of using frequencies to manipulate matter. Uh, once, I, once, I've, once I've fully got the big picture of, of the, uh, the concept and, and the way it was working, I started creating my own ideas and creating more effective ways to make it happen even faster. Um, so technically, um, I basically took something that was already there, that was already on this planet and other planets, basically using frequencies. Uh, the frequencies is what, it's, it's, is what uh, makes these products very effective. You know, once I, I, I've studied about five years working on these products, and um, now they're just manifesting and they're working great. Uh, we don't use no type of machinery or any type of hardware. We, we use uh, supernatural uh, abilities to make these very effective for the people. This is a whole new field of science. This is, this is pure soul science powered by love. Love and intention. That's it. Right. That's it. Right. Most people don't really understand what frequencies are or how they work. So maybe you can talk about how we have that energetic field right. and how the frequencies will just lift us up or okay. correct what's incorrect, if right, you will. Right, right, what? right. Well, you... yeah, yeah. Well, frequencies, everything is a frequency. Everything around us is a frequency. Love, hate, those are all frequencies. When you say them, they vibrate. Uh, they go out through the atmosphere, the universe, and so on and so forth. Uh, I've, I've developed a unique system where I can just pull the frequencies out of thin air. Just pull it. Uh, once, we, once we have the frequencies and it's been confirmed by myself and my crew, uh, we then take those frequencies and store them into devices such as these. This is a cancer buster. It's a, it's a cancer busting coaster that busts up the cancers. There's precancerous cells uh, uh, buster in there, and just by charging your water, you uplift your body, put yourself in a higher state of vibration where the cancer disappears. So basically, different frequencies are added into different products that you're yes, you're offering, or, or the hollows. Right, right. And then when someone uses that to charge their food or their body, it lifts their vibration up to correct the um, issue that they have, the imbalance, yep. or it just raises their vibration it, so it, it's protective in nature. Yeah, it, it pretty much brings everybody to a higher state uh, uh, of consciousness. Right. Um, and it's it's I've been charged to to do it, right? So that's why you know we're charging the planet, right? So it's 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 been exciting. So you know it's 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 far out there for some people to understand, and I get a lot a lot of uh, you know naysayers and stuff like that, especially the ones that say, "How does a sticker do that?" Yeah. Easy. I ask Daddy, which I call I call Source God. Uh, uh, the all living God. Everybody got their own name for it, but Daddy's allowed to allowed me to generate frequencies in the palm of my hand. It's that simple. People don't understand the source connection right. and how easy right. we can have it. Right. Well, I think part of the problem that we have is that we're all disconnected from source That's in many right. ways. That's so right. we're sitting there with our phones and our technology 24 seven. 
we're rather busy in our day, so we're running around, we're harried, we're, everything's automated, electric, it's fast, 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 and we are not connecting to the earth or, you know, to nature in any way, and, um, or, or each other in any way, so uh, we're disconnected and all these unusual things are popping up, and that's, we don't even right. realize that we're not right. That's right, and that, that we're that's, out of that's why my work is so important, because it changes all that, no yeah. matter where you're at. You can be in a city, and as long as you have one of the pendants or, or even a hologram, it'll change your whole field of, right. of, of you know. The vibratory yeah, field. Yeah, I mean, right. there's stories where people are literally standing next to each other, and one person sees chemtrails, mm -hmm. the other person sees... A beautiful sky. Right. That's because of the vibration. I mean, we're all interdimensional right. beings at, at the end of the day. Right. So I mean, it's, it's my. That's why I feel my work is important. Some some people are heavily against it, but majority of the people they love what I do. I mean, I offer my holograms for free, and the the, uh, the testimonies are phenomenal. So. I know I listen to many of your your calls and I have really enjoyed them and what I like is that you're very creative in the way that you assist people so yeah. let's let's before we go into all that let's um, find out a little bit about your childhood how okay. you know kind of how you grew up okay. and um, like have you been doing this forever kind of well, thing well no um, but I did have uh, I was born in uh, Bones of Puerto Rico um, a lot of people are aware of the UFO activity that happens over there um, my mother is RH negative, so you know, so according to modern day sciences, that's alien DNA or whatnot. Um, but uh, yeah, I, I've, I've, I was born in Puerto Rico and then I grew up in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, where I started attending special education programs in school because of my learning disability. I mean, we don't read and write up there, you know what I mean? So I, they, they considered me having a disability in reading and writing. But when they did the test, when they did the test on me, my IQ was over 250. So you know they had me doing, uh, they had me in special rooms where I was, com you know, hooking up. Uh, back in the day, Legos weren't popular when when I was messing with them. I would hook up Legos up to wires and then onto the computers and making them work. Mm. So that's the type of stuff that I was doing back then. And then I even considered that board boring right. so um, as the years went on you know I got older and older and older and uh, I decided to leave school because I wasn't learning anything right I um, I pretty much took I went from fifth grade to sixth grade to seventh grade in only two months I got in trouble for taking the science book off of the shelves and reading the whole thing and doing the whole thing so there were no teachers that could really uh, see that you were different and support you. That's right. Yeah. So we're going to change all that. Now, how did your parents react to all that? Well, I mean, my, just, my parents, they're just, you know, ordinary folks that wanted, wanted the best for me. So right. they would argue with me because I didn't want to wake up and go to school. <laughs> I mean, they didn't understand me, you know. I mean, to this day, some of my family members don't understand right. me. So right. it's nothing new for me. Yeah. Um, and then as, as I was growing up... Um, you know, I got a job at Bird King. Uh, I lasted there for two weeks when I realized that this isn't for me and I'm not going to make somebody else rich, right? So I left Burger King and then I went into the streets. You know, that was kind of like my, my, my cover to be, you know, to, to walk into who I am. Uh, I, unfortunately, I was in the streets selling everything I could get my hands on. A lot of it wasn't good, but I don't take, I don't. I don't regret anything, only because everything that I was doing gave me the freedom to learn right. Right. and to be effective in what I'm doing now. And, and we were just talking before we started this video about how we have lived, I, I won't say lives of hardship because we are very lucky the way we live, but we've, we haven't had it easy, most of us, and I think it's because we need to develop compassion for others so that we can help them, and we, we know that you know what they're going through so we're able to help them right. uh, more effectively than someone that doesn't understand yeah that's, so, that's the most important part you know it's it's not always money I mean money is a big part of our issue right. but um, we haven't had the comforts that many have had and 
and or the support. That's going to change too. And I, I think though, <laughs> you know, our parents, you know, didn't know what to do when then they have a child that's different in some way. They right. don't know what to do either, mm -hmm. you know. And and back then, especially, it's it was less talked about than it is now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I've I've had some crazy experiences. I mean, mm -hmm. when, when I was about seven years old, I take apart uh, paper plates and my remote control car. Car had wires, batteries, switches, and lights. I didn't know what I was doing at the time, but I took a, I took apart the styrofoam cups. I mean, the plates, put holes in it, put the wiring in it, put lights on the bottom, and I was flying around the UFO. Oh, yeah. I didn't know what it was at the time. Right, right. Now it's like okay. Yeah. Now I fully understand. Yeah. yeah. So it's kind of like it's kind of like you know it's all coming at me and you know the things that I've done, the things that I've gone through. It's made me the, the man I am today, yeah. and I'm, yeah. I'm proud of myself. So that's awesome. I came I came a long way. It's so interesting that many that are, you know, um, connected with ETs and UFOs, like mm -hmm. you you gravitated to that way back when you were a kid, and now yeah. now look what Ima you're doing. Imagine imagine yeah. imagine when you find out you're actually the one uh, uh, in command of them. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine that. Right. So right. so um, let's talk about the spiritual aspect of what you do. I mean, so you're, you're working with frequencies or a new technology. And when we think of technology, we think of something physical, like a Hardware, computer yeah. with wires. It's got to be plugged software. in. And, and what you're doing is like kind of intangible. It's invisible. It's, it's, it's invisible. It's invisible depending on what dimension you're in. I'm able to work in all dimensions. Meaning, I can I can pull anything from any dimension and bring it here to this dimension, which is which is what I've been doing, and I prove it over and over and over again. Um, basically, when you when you when your third eye is open, you can see certain things, and a lot of us have it, a lot of us don't. But you know, they'll get there. We'll make sure they get there. So basically, mm -hmm. I'll see the frequencies in either a cold or a or a uh, a light. And I'll pull it out like that and then place it wherever I need to be. Like this. Okay. Yeah. Simple as that. Right. They, what I was told, source told me, which is another word for God, creator, whatever you want to call it. Uh, source told me that what I'm doing, not even the quantum physics will understand for years to come. So imagine that. This is a whole new field of technology. This is something that the modern day science books will not get. Yeah. Oh, and I'm unstoppable. So, I'm not, <laughs> you know, right, right. And so, so let me ask a question then. What are you doing with these frequencies? Like, what what do you do with these? Once you have a frequency for cancer or anti cancer, whatever we'll call it, what do you do with it then? Well, what we do is these. These uh these devices, even the holograms, already have a. Uh, you ever took a picture of orbs? Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, took a photo and you see orbs in it. Mm -hmm. Well, there's an orb around each device, each product, and all we're doing is adding frequencies to that orb. So once we put the frequencies there, it's permanent. Right. The energy is permanent. Right. So, whatever frequency we need, we generate it and we add it to it. All right. Simple as that. I, I know that you have um, calls that you do. Mm -hmm. uh, well, they're five days a week, basically. They're far out there. Yeah. And what you're doing is you're trying to help other people to duplicate what you're doing so that right. they can tune into something, maybe an injustice, and try to heal it in some way. That's right. That's so right. tell me kind of, a, like, give us an overview of the calls and kind of how those run. And then I'd like to know more about really what motivates you to do what okay. you're doing. I mean, you're really doing what you're doing 24-7. You're working, you're co-processing probably even as we speak right now. I'm but, always working. It's, yeah. it's non-stop. Yeah. I mean, I, I'm, I know that I'm a multi-dimensional being, very powerful, and I need to do what I'm doing. Right. So. Right. But basically, the cause are about, um, uh, first of all, I'm the king of the golden race. Everybody has to get over that simple fact. <laughs> I'm the king of the golden race, and I'm, I'm here to do my part in, in raising the consciousness of humanity and changing the way we do things. Uh, on the cause, I teach people how to transfer source energy to um, heal people and alter reality. That's what I was originally here to do. 
back in the old times, 19,000 years ago. We'll get to that down the line. Uh, but basically, it's it's we're powered by love, man. I mean, love is the most right. important part of what I do. And I'm teaching people how to transfer love energy to heal each other. Right. We've used, um, what I do is we have these, they're pendulums. Everybody knows, not everybody, but people know how to use these. We use these to get confirmation. Some people do muscle testing, and some people have higher guides, higher selves, uh, source connection. Everybody can do it. I'm just making sure that connection is stronger than ever, and we become very effective as a, uh, as a, you know, a, a planetary body. Because at the end of the day, we are the strongest beings ever created in this universe, and I'm gonna make sure we, we uh, reached to uh, how you say we reach our fullest potential right i'm gonna make sure of it right it's guaranteed yeah it was written well <laughs> yeah. and see we it, this is what i would teach someone we are god goddess creator of all that is we have god powers but mm -hmm. we don't realize that we do and right. so if the dark forces are whispering whispering in our ear it, what do we create what they're influencing us to create right, because right, right. we don't realize that we have the power to do otherwise well i mean that's why they go on cnn and put out all yeah. this stuff and yep. blah 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 and pe shows. people create it yeah. so i'm teaching people how one of us can end right. and cancel all right. of that one person can change the world. That's right. One we're, person we're, can we're, affect the world. That's right. And right. we're doing it. We're making it right. happen. Right. But just think if we all teamed up and got organized. Whoa. Well, it, no. And that's what we're doing. That's what we're calls. doing. That's what I was about to say. Yeah. That's what we're doing. Yeah. That's what we're doing. So that's what we're doing with the calls is uh, Smarty is teaching people how to tune into themselves, get the answers that they need, and to help themselves, their right. family, and the community. Right, and the right. planet. And there's there's no sickness or no problem that we can't fix. We, uh, when we do when we do uh, healings for sickness, some of it happens instantly. Right. Some of it takes time, depending right. on what it is. And also, people's faith can can alter it. Right. But we're 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 finding out that slowly but surely we're even breaking through that. Right. I mean, we've been lied to for so long. It's it's yeah. it's it's sad. Right. It's sad. So, you know, um, that's why it's hard for people to, 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 to understand or wrap their head around my concept and what, right. what, this, what this stuff is right. doing here. But, you know, when I put, when I put a, 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 a EMF sticker on my phone and then use the EMF machine to prove that it's been canceled out on a sticker, and it's mm -hmm. like, huh? It was a very effective video. How I did saw. you do that? Yeah. Yeah. Not only that, we have did it live at your expo. Yeah. And people were just like blown away. Yeah. I mean, they bought charms. Yeah. You know, and that's the main thing. And that's my, it's not the main thing, but these charms here are literally a database. Every time we generate new frequencies, they automatically get that's loaded awesome. to that charm. So your charm. We got protection from ET forces. We got protection from, you know, everybody. I noticed when I started wearing some of the products, um, I initially had more attacks, more psychic attacks. And, and, and it was pretty awful, actually, for about a month. And then they started dissipating, and now it's very infrequent. I call it detox. Yeah. And, um, <laughs> so I'm loving that. Yeah, but, it's, it's uh, detox. Yeah. Yeah. So, so talk, talk a little bit about what your, what, like your passions are, what your motivation is. Like, um, what, you know, with these products, what are you after? Like, what are you trying to do? And what, what drives you here in, in creating the new ones? Well... Basically, I'm worried. I, not my kids and everyone else's kids is my main priority. I want to make sure they have clean air. I want to make sure they have clean water, clean green grass. And I'm getting, I'm getting emotional. Yeah. But a beautiful planet to live in. And and wouldn't it be great if people were there for their benefit? People were teaching them the truth. If I didn't have to pay bills, yeah. this would be free. Yeah. So. <clears throat> that's where that's where I want to be. Right, right. <laughs> so you want to help people is really the bottom that's line. All, that's You're it. here to help people. That's it. That's why I offer this stuff free. You don't have yeah. to. You don't have to buy none of my products. Right. You can go on my website and get it for free. Yeah, right. And I've got I've got both. 
and I love them all. And a lot of times I'm like, oh, I should probably give some, you know this to so and so, and I'm like, oh, I don't want to. I want to keep it myself. But well, when you about, when, when when you invited me to, to speak at the right. expo, I, I I seen a, an awesome opportunity to to secretly help people. And the way we did it was, I made a sticker for you so that they could put right. it on their cell phones. Right. And cancel out the radiation, right. and I even put cancer killing frequencies in those stickers. Right. So I mean, not That's good. not only that, it's 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 changing their environment. Right. You know, so it's we're changing people's lives, and they don't even realize it. It's great, isn't it? And then the Jedi's, the Jedi's on the real truth call, they're working to change people's lives, and they don't even know we exist. You know. Right. So. Well, I, I participated in the calls, and at first it was a little hard because I didn't know people and I didn't really understand, but as it went on, I really enjoyed the calls, and what I loved was the create the creative way that you would take a problem and work it till you found the solution. So time. a lot of times what I'll do is I'll, I'll send you, like if I see an un unpleasant video or whatever, I'll send that to you because I'm like, we got to work on this. Um, but, like, I, I remember one call, they were saying, we want to see a lot of rainbows. And, like, the next day, everybody was posting pictures of double rainbows and unusual rainbows out there right. as confirmation. So, <laughs> so things like that. It's very interesting. And I know you've worked on healing specific right, kids right, or, right, 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 right. or people with issues, and they have healed, that's like, right. by magic. So yeah, that's, that's very what, that's exciting. That's what they call it. Yeah. Uh, it's supernatural. I mean, yeah. that's what it is. Yeah, the rainbow. I mean, you know, in, in, in biblical times, the rainbow was a was a uh, was a, a uh, how you say uh, an omen, maybe. Well, um, yeah, you can say that, but it was like um, it was a significant uh, significant thing, like um, you know, a promise, if you would. Right. So basically, you know, we're bringing in we're bringing in the the golden race, golden. Uh, rainbow bodies, um, the warriors of the rainbows, the king of the golden race. I mean, if you if you use your pendulums to 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 confirm what I'm saying, everything checks out. Right. I mean, if it wouldn't, if it wasn't true, I wouldn't even say it. Right. That's not what I'm about. That's not what I'm here to do. And that's what makes me more even even more powerful because I speak truth. Right. Some of it may not be easy for people to take in, right. but. How are we going to move and evolve as a species if we're being lied to all the time? Well, one of the programs that we've been taught since birth is that if anyone steps out of the line, if they believe in horoscopes and astrology, or if they see something that's not physically there, we discipline them to get back in the line by right. ridiculing them, ostracizing them, shunning them, whatever it might be. That's so right. we are the, the most effective form of mind control in our society Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, like a lot of people that are psychic or have grown up with special abilities are afraid to tell people. Well, you and see, you see what they've been doing since, since back then, yeah. since, since the crucifixion on a tree yeah. and then with burning witches and stuff like that yeah. because of their abilities, because yeah. they were afraid. And even if you said somebody was a witch, like if they were a healer or whatever, they'd be killed. And it's like, they're trying to help people. It doesn't make sense. But we've been programmed to do that for thousands of years. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. very effective programming. That's that's all that's all changing right yeah. now and we see it. Yeah. And and a lot of the people that I see doing good, we we, uh, we provide source protection. Uh, my crew is everywhere. Right. My ships, I have the angels, the company of heaven. Um, we're we're not we're not playing games. Right. You know, I, I mean some people say I got an ego, but ego was a cabal uh, a created word, mm -hmm. and um, when you speak truth, there is no ego. I didn't know that. It is true. You right. can verify with your pendulum. Okay. You know, I, I mean, right. these are things that we've checked. I've checked over the years. I wanted to be certain. I wanted to be spot on. Every time I say something, it's the truth. Right. You know, and even like, there's a lot of things going on right now that is awesome, especially the Q movement. I mean, I'm wearing a Q hat that I was. Somebody sent me in. It says, the plan to save the world. You can't get better than that. We're working on this planet in so many different levels that on higher levels, we're all connected. So that's why the latest report says that the Cabal, Illuminati, whatever you want to call themselves, Draco Reptilians, are, are pretty much surrounded. I mean, they're finished. I, 
I'm not yeah. even going to go. <laughs> I love I love hearing this story. I'm not you already know. I'm, I'm for real. I'm for real. I'm for real and they're afraid of me. Right. And they should be. Right. Because the, the enough is enough. Right. We're not taking no prisoners. We're not gonna do what they did and put people on a different planet where this happens over and over again. This is the last cycle and that's just the way it is. You either you either you either get with the program, which is love and light. Or you get sent to source. You don't want to go to source. I hear it's worse than. I'm not even gonna say. <laughs> okay. Well, let's <laughs> let's talk about this then. Let's talk about what the future of Holotech is. Like, what are your plans? Like, well, I, I I know you're gonna keep it out there. Yeah, you know, yeah. And, well, and, the, and it's the gonna morph. The future of Holotech is there's there's a lot of things coming down the pipeline as far as funding for everyone. And the future of Holotech will be me sitting on a beach <laughs> with, uh, with white sand, with my wife and kids, yep. playing in the sand yep. and um, charging things from there. Cool. And then uh, having having a, a whole, a whole uh, you know, like, like how you say, facility or, or uh, uh, some type of, well, yeah, like a facility yeah. lab where we're making things and giving it away. Right. Period. What I love is that you have come up with some unique products and like things that, um, you know, have the frequency in right. that are really easy to use and, right. and they're like passive for the most part. The person, you know, doesn't have to do anything other than maybe set their mug on a coaster, the fat burner coaster, for example. <laughs> Notice I've got this one I'm hogging. <laughs> you, 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 know, you know, that's what makes people not believe it. Yeah. It's passive. Yeah. It's awesome. So why wouldn't you do, like if, if we can prove that they work through your video with mm -hmm. the phone thing, why wouldn't you want a couple things? Download them from the internet for free right, right, and right. use. Right, right. You so, don't you don't have to I mean that's that's a lot of the times people just post on my YouTube yeah. channel or post on comments and say st stupid shit. Excuse yeah. my friends, but <laughs> but I mean if you don't believe it, try it. Yeah. Yeah. Go find somebody with cancer. Go find one of your family members that are sick. Download it. It's free. Right. Try it. Well, Instead of talking, you know, running your mouth, go try it. Yeah. I mean, you what have you really to nothing to lose. It's a piece of paper. But I do want to say, I do want to say, if you don't plan on sticking around for 200 years or more, don't even touch my stuff, okay? <laughs> Look at me. I'm 41. I'm, I'm about to be 41, and I'm dead sexy. <laughs> All right, going back to the interview. <laughs> uh, All right, so we've talked about you're going to continue to develop products. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the yeah. frequencies will yeah. morph, morph, morph. Yeah, we're, we're, we're getting all types of stuff, and um, I, I got my wife involved, yep. so she's getting stuff, and we're just, awesome. you know, it's teamwork. We're, so we're, we're going we're gonna to see physical manifestation of the changes you've been affecting on the earth, and we can, are already can, seeing Yeah, that. you can see it already. Right. You can even see my development, because in 2000 and, and, uh, in 2013 is when I created the Holotech chat group which is where we're broadcasting right. live right okay. now. So, I mean, you can see some of the older products and then some of the new products from start to finish. You can see how I was, you know, even some of my audios and my, my uh, recorded uh, um, shows, things have changed and they've gotten better and better and better. Yeah. I mean, before we, it used to take time for certain illnesses to leave your body. Now what we did was the illness will literally evaporate. And, and if, if one of my products don't work, then I'll just remove you and take it out of you. That's how serious I am. I think what happens for most people is they have a thought pattern. So their, their energy is vibrating. Let's say they, let's just use the word cancer. They have cancer. Right. And so they, have, they know they have it. It's been diagnosed. They're vibrating at that frequency. Mm -hmm. Of course, they've got anxiety and fear. And then they have the cancer buster. So then they're hoping that it works, and it starts to work, but then they go back to that vibration of fear. And so it feels to me like they're probably flip-flapping back and forth because mm -hmm. they have a strong vibration or, or belief system in what, like, say, the traditional medicine has right, been telling right, them. Right. Well, yeah, that, that's the, a good point. Where people are that are more open... Boom, they're and healed. That, and that, that's, that's, that's a good point, actually. And, and that's why I created the whole Holotech program, right. um, the Facebook group. Because you can, you, you can go in there and read other testimonies from other people. Right. 
I don't even have to say nothing no more. It, the proof is in the pudding, you know? Right. They have very... People that haven't used the products, all you have to do is download a free ho hollow from the website, right. hollowtech.biz. Right. You pick the one that uh, appeals to you with the issues that you have. And what you can do is laminate them and put them under your, your drink, onto your dinner plate, under your pillow, wherever you sit at night, and they will start to bring those healing frequencies and vibrations into your energetic field. That's right. And start working on whatever your issue is. That's simple. And you've got, like, I don't know, hundreds of them? I don't yeah, even know what the yeah, count is. I even yeah. got I even got some, some on there that, that are just far out there. Yeah. Like, for instance, I got one that says levitation. You know, people look at that and like, oh, this dude's crazy. No. Levitation. We used to know how to do that. Levitation, what? Teleportation. Look, teleportation. That's, that's the one I want. My bracelets help you teleport. Yeah. These, these, what I'm doing is I'm laying the groundwork. Right. You know, the basis. Right. Because once we start developing and start realizing that this is for real. Right. You know, we're, we're evolving. We're not going to stay. You know, I like to say we're moving from the Flintstones to the Jetsons. I was told it was going to be a hundred, sorry, I was, I was told it was going to be a hundred year cleanup. I said, yeah, we'll see. Well, I like that. <laughs> so let's, can we, t can we talk about a couple other things that are a little bit on the fringe of the mainstream? Ooh. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, which is, you know, actually, it's my interest. So, all right. So the future of you as a person. Right. Let's talk about that. The future of, of me as a person yeah. is, is going to be a bit shocking for even myself. Only because there's certain things that I know that will happen and it will it will literally shock people. Um, and it's 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 it, I mean it's 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 gonna be wild. It's gonna be wild. Right. Even the closest people to me don't even realize who I really am. I I've seen in the in the short time that I've known you, I've seen um, well I've seen the products become more and more interesting right. and creative and your talks and your groups have gotten so creative. Like if, if they there's a block to the energy that you're trying to uh, bring or to the healing that you're trying to bring, you don't just drop it and say, Oh, it's not working. You try you, to figure, you it, figure out. it out. And I love I'm the, the fastest, creativity. I'm the fastest in provider I know. Yeah. I mean when you when you know when you know you're a multi-dimensional being, you look at products here, there, there, there. Not products, sorry. Yeah. You look at problems here, yeah. there, yeah. there, 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 and then you, 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 you've seen it in your head twenty times on how it would work, and then twenty times how it wouldn't work. Then you go for the one that's that looks more, you know, more workable. More, more workable. So when we're working on somebody and there's blocks. We go straight to the block, and the thing I like about the teamwork on the, on the uh, the Jedi sessions is that the people that been uh, working on on these Jedi sessions with us, they're evolving. They're seeing things faster and right. faster. We have I've we, noticed that. we have one guy who's actually taking pictures of the beings that are visiting his house. Oh, cool! So I mean, yeah. we can tap into everything. Um, I, I there is certain things that I can't do, and there is something certain things that I'm not allowed to do yet. But um, there's other people that can, and we can all tap into it. So um, one of us will remote view the situation. One of us will get answers, blah, blah, blah. And then we all of it. Right. You know, and then. I love that. Yeah, when, 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 when somebody sees something, I'll, it'll, it'll light up. You'll see it light up, and then I can see it. And then, you know, for instance, we have people with cancer and, and thyroid problems. We repaired right. it right on the spot. Right. You know, people that couldn't move, they're walking. And we're doing it right on the spot. Like I said, some of the stuff is is, is uh, some some of it's instantly, and some of it takes time. Right. Depending on what it is. I think it's like I said, a lot of it's belief system, and and we've been programmed since. Like when I was a kid, if somebody had a heart attack, they died. Right. Like there was no coming back from that. Where right, now right, right. we have so much more, mm -hmm. you know, like. I, I guess you'd say progression in the medical field. I right, don't right, know right. that I agree with that totally, but um, yeah, have. there's, there's. I mean, we have different things like, like this, uh, this future. Yeah. You put this on your, on your door, on your gas tank. Your car starts steaming. Mm -hmm. I mean, that, that alone would mess up your day when you thought stuff like this wasn't possible. Right. But if you're open to it, 
I mean, people see this stuff and they're like, whoa, what yeah. else you got? Yeah. You know, then we start yeah. showing It's cool, them isn't it? Yeah. This is this is the newest product. This is uh this is a uh you heard of osmosis and, and alkaline water systems and stuff like that. Well we got all that in the frequency now. Love that. Not only that, this product when you when you put oil and butter down your, your, your drain, this will make sure it doesn't get clogged. Wow. So I mean, I'm telling you, so the products, frequency. they're they're passive, so you literally have to do nothing. Try it. You don't. You just have to put it wherever, wear it, put it under your drink, and it works. So <laughs> right. like, why wouldn't someone try it? Right. right? right I right, love right. that. And, and they're 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 not expensive. Yeah. I mean, look, how much money has has the hospitals, right? The doctors, taken for cancer right, patients? Right. How much? Billions, 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 trillions, billions, I don't know. Billions. Yeah, um, and of course, you know, I always love it when they're, you know, you're supposed to donate to these charities to cure cancer. And I used to be like everyone else and say, of course, I want to help other people and all that. The money really doesn't go to the people for most of those charities. It doesn't. And I know that cancer isn't just generally a random thing. Yeah, I mean, we've already, we've already proven it. I mean, right. that's why there's... That's why the whole Q, the Q stuff is happening now right. because they know it. They have everybody's text right. messages. They know where all the money's going in, right. uh, going to, and right. you know they're 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 going to pay uh, heavy heavy prices for it. Right. So you know, and I'm putting the energy behind it to make sure it happens because enough is enough. Pretty excited about no that. One, no one's going to suppress yeah. you know my race. <laughs> I want the truth to come out. And I know people are going to, for the most part, the mainstream people are going to lose their minds. And I think that's why we're here is to support them. But I want the truth out there. And I want, you know, of course, the clean earth and the healthy earth. And I want us to, to, to know what really happened. Our history is so that's convoluted right. and corrupted. That's right. And then, you, you know, we're purposely being killed. That's right. And I, I don't love it. I don't like people controlling me like that. Not at all. Not so, at all. So, um, let's talk a little bit about what you'll be doing at the expo. Okay. And, uh, well, well, I mean, I, I could I, talk about it, or you can. No, I mean, <laughs> it's, it's fine. We'll just have a dialogue. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'll, I'll be there, um, you know, setting up my booth, talking to people. Um, you know, it's growing, which is cool. We got people from all around the country contacting me, saying that they'll be there, um, you know, and... and, and it's, I love it. I love it. Yeah. I mean, we we've 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 did a lot of work at your expos. Um, I've been attacked with with weaponry, not even of this planet, at your expos. But I think it was necessary because we need to clean these things up. Right. And I'm the only one that can do it the way I do it. You know. I mean, you can have you can you can put up your field and do your little prayer. Not, not, <laughs> We're not gonna me. do it anyways. Not okay? me. Not, I'm, just, anyway. I'm just saying. Not me. I'll just go in there and wipe them all out. Cool. I mean, that's what happens when, when I walk into a room. Just my presence alone destroys right. negative right. forces. Before you leave, let's walk through the house, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. So you'll be uh, there at your booth all at weekend booth, answering yeah. questions, meeting people. And I will also say people gravitate to the booth. They yeah, love they to look at your things and touch them. Oops. And, uh, of course, talk to Smarty. So. Yeah, and then you, I, yeah, we have people that, that are, are, yeah. are real truth callers, yeah. you know, with Dr. WC, the real truth caller, yeah. and they actually come up there, and I know them, and I feel them, and I see them, and I hear them, and I'm like, yeah, what's up? Yeah, isn't it great? I get, yeah, yeah, I give them a it's hug. What's up, Smarty? Right. Man, you know, a lot, of the, a lot of the people can't come to see me, but if they, if they had me too, they would. Right. I mean, even when I first started on the call, and, and told everybody what I can do. We've got thousands of, of literally human angels, light workers, whatever you want to call yourselves, ready to take action. Right. Um, we're just waiting for that final right. Right. push of right. the button. And it, yeah, perfect. That's it. Right. But um, yeah, well, I'll be there Saturday doing the presentation, yeah. talking about all the stuff. Um, um, you know, the best part about the presentation is, is, is my opinion, is the agriculture the agricultural part right because i've sent products to africa and the way the food is growing out there is phenomenal i saw those video or those pictures that, that so tell tell the audience what you did because it, you're going to talk about it again in the presentation right, right, but right. seeing it was like mind blowing because right, right. i know you told me that before i yeah, saw I the do, pictures i do a lot of things for this planet and people don't even people realize don't know. sometimes I, I it feels like damn nobody's giving me credit for it but yeah. 
My father's, my father's up there. Nobody is giving you credit for it. And I know you're attacked a lot. I see it on, you know, social media. And it's fine. I guess what I'd say is like, just let them, let them be. Like, uh, if they want to, I'll tell them to kick rocks. If they don't believe you, <laughs> let them go on, and they're just wasting your time and energy. Right. But, um, well, my energy is forever, so they're not wasting shit. All right. Excuse my French. So for for someone that's <laughs> open minded and might like to try it, they can literally try your products right. for free at, right, right. at the so, website. So what I did for in 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 Africa, I um I created little organ pendants that I bought. I bought the little molds. And then I, I, I got rope chains, and I sent them out to Africa for the children in an orphanage, mm-hmm. and also sent out um, packages of seeds from all sorts, all different types of vegetables, fruits, and all right. that. And I cleaned out the seeds from GMOs and all that before I even sent With it. With frequencies. Right. I cleaned it all out, made it all organic, okay. because um, Daddy created it all, they destroyed it, and I fixed it. Right. I sent it out there to them, and I also sent out uh, different uh, uh, frequencies for uh, stickers with frequencies to grow the food 10 times faster and 10 times stronger. Right. So the proof is in the pudding. I sent it out there. They did, they did exactly what I told them to do, and you can see, you can see right. the, the, the crops. Yeah. Right. I mean, the banana trees, they're, they're literally, you know, they can use more help. Um, and he's a part of my Facebook group, the right. guy that I sent it to. So. Oh, cool. So, um, you know, it's, I love doing well, what I do. Well, when I saw those pictures, I was so, like, I had forgotten the story, actually. I was just, my heart was so happy. But um, I, oh my golly, I did go to I'd Africa. I'd expect guess. Yeah, it's probably the post uh, <laughs> Um I had gone to Egypt uh, a couple months ago, and I was shocked. What well, city police? I was shocked at the lack of food there. I guess we should wrap up. Yeah. Or that's pause fine. it. That's Can we fine. pause? I don't know. We'll see. All right, guys. We're going to do another video in two seconds. All right. See you. Sorry.